when we think back to our childhood, we remember football in the park, hosepipe water fights, and stories read from your favourite bedtime books. Once upon a time. In a world where your blankets were forts, coats were capes, and the shed in your garden sent you into outer space, imagination was endless. But can we say the same for today's children? In a survey conducted by The Independent in 2018, it was reported that 25% of children under the age of six owned a smartphone. This statistic significantly increases to over 95% when compared to adolescents. Toddlers have iPads now, and some people will say that's terrible, a toddler's got an iPad, what are they doing? And I think if you saw a toddler completely engrossed in something that was relatively passive and mindless and didn't involve language development and didn't involve numeracy development and um, then then I would probably be quite concerned about that as an educator. As children are born into a technology driven society we shape a generation of digital natives which leads us to question how is this affecting their creative ability? It changes the ways in the, the options for behaving create, creatively. Tools such as GarageBand let, let young people be creative musically, create music without having any musical knowledge. In fact, it can allow them to be more creative if we think about things like um, YouTube and how um, children enjoy producing and creating their own films. Research on technology's impact on children is still ongoing. The long-term effects will be discovered only as the children reach adulthood. In 20 years' time we might be able to say what we know about this a bit more, but um, we will have to wait and see, I think.